Hi, welcome to CapeCast. I'm Connie Barron, Public Information Director for the City of Cape Coral, Florida. Here is your three-minute news update for the week of January 21st, 2013. City Council will be back at work on Monday, January the 28th. They have several items to discuss and vote on on Monday. One of those items will be a $1 million paving contract. There are six roads set to receive some asphalt in this contract. They're in the North and South Cape. Portions of Jacaranda Parkway, Kismet Parkway, and Rotunda Parkway will receive some paving. Also in the South Cape, we will be putting some asphalt down on Academy Boulevard, Cornwallis Parkway, and Palm Tree Boulevard. The entire roads won't be paved, just portions of them. Another item on the agenda is the fleet manager position. City Council will be, will be voting to create a new position. This position was recommended by the fleet committee. As you might recall, they completed a report that did a SWOT analysis and had some short-term, mid-term, and long-term objectives. They also had some action items. This was one of them, so Council will be deciding on that on Monday. Another position on the agenda for Monday will be the Human Resources Director. The Human Resources Department was reestablished through the budget process, fiscal year 2013 budget process. So the city manager would like to hire a new HR director. Council will be discussing that on Monday. Lake Kennedy Senior Center remains closed. As I mentioned last week, there was a leak, caused a lot of damage, still closed. We'll let you know when it reopens. The CRA Board, which is the City Council, rejected the executive director's recommendation to terminate the contract employees. They will remain employed through the fiscal year. The UEP will be having a workshop on February the 20th. We're not going to have one on February 6th. We really don't have any updates at that point, but on February the 20th, we'll be discussing the SRF funds, state revolving funds. If we get those, it's a great interest rate around 2%. Our fire chief, Bill Van Helden, will be retiring. He only has about another week and a half. Bill's been with us for a number of years now. He's calling it a career, and he's actually going to be going to Charlotte County and working up there. We wish him a lot of luck. In the meantime, Jimmy Heikla will be the acting fire chief. So good luck to both of you. That is your three-minute news update. I'll see you next week on CapeCast. I'm Connie Barron. Have a good week.